Bride of Higara. This is Captain Soban of the fleet, Farron Shah. Looks like you could use a hand. Attention all Sobani, pick your targets and engage. Hello everyone. Hello, hello. This is Captain Soban. Welcome aboard the Starship at Norma Prize for another episode of Star Ruler. Okay, so before we really get into this, um, one thing I noticed when I was editing the last episode, I made a slight error when it comes to the advanced parts um, uh, minor ship. And the error was that I did my conversion wrong. So, electronics require one metal to produce, and advanced parts require one metal and one electronic produce, which means there are a ratio for this in order to work properly. It's supposed to be two metals, one electronic, to one advanced part. Instead of, I think what I have a setup to is one, one, and an advanced part. Since we're building all this from scratch, if we were like importing the metal or whatnot, this wouldn't be this big of a deal. So, we need to go ahead and set that up. Uh, let's see, we are 7-7. Seven, seven. We're producing 13 right now. And let's see, we have 14. Uh, we probably actually need to change this a little bit too, but I think all this has just been updated because of the uh, some of the research going on. I think advanced parts require some sort of other update in order for it to, up to uh, improve its production. But we'll get it all synced for now. So we need um, you to be 14. Uh, actually, we need to probably shrink you down to 12 because we need more room for metal. And then that means we need to make you guys six. Uh, boop. And you guys both need to be 12. So we will produce 22 metal. And then half of that will be, wait a minute, that's 24. And half of that, which is 12, will be converted into electronics. And then the other half will be converted into um, advanced parts. So this should work a lot better. So we have 12 that we are exporting. You need to be 12 as well. Now we have too much room. There we go. That should work perfectly. So let's go ahead and save that. I believe our electronics should be working just fine. Uh, we have 32, 32. Oh, hang on. 32, 32, 18. These are all supposed to be synced together. Hmm. Just probably why this wasn't working properly. Okay. Uh huh. Let's shrink you guys down to 10. Bring this up to 20. This is 21. There we go. Make you larger. Shrink you down. Probably make you 24, 12, 12, and 12.7. I don't really need more fuel. Guess we'll make better thrusters. Something like that. That should work better. So that's 24. 
12, 12, which is 24. And then that. Much better. And then the main one should still be good. Although we're going to go ahead and upgrade this to antimatter. Uh, let's see, what do we rent? Mine at 16, 16. I need to redesign these once we get our entire um, uh, 10 level of research going. This would be 32. Boop, boop, boop. Thirty-two. Don't need this much fuel. Okay. Move you up to forty. Now this one will export 41 um, metal per second. Cool. We still don't really need any cargo because we're just mining and refining and exporting. Alright, what does the other ones do then? So you do 41 metal. You do... Uh, for our advanced parts... We do 12 and electronics 21 so 42 metal 21 electronics and 12 advanced parts okay cool I'm gonna go ahead and send all these over here to get themselves retrofitted they have all of their stuff up to date. Retrofit. And then these guys over here, get them retrofitted. Alrighty. Oh, and there was one more thing I wanted to do too. Um, I wanted to switch out the haulers. Um, to make them solar powered so they don't have to see the movement and everything. So let's go ahead and take care of that. Because they're, they're, they're supposed to be in a solar system anyway, so to make them solar powered would make a lot of sense. So let's get rid of you. Plus I haven't updated these since we started the game. Get rid of the fuel. Let's also make a drone. Because we don't really need a whole lot of control for these things. So let's put the hole in the middle. The drone. Eh. So like right, maybe right here. And then solar panel. We'll give a couple small ones for it. Act us a little bit closer together. One like right there. Another one right here. But again, if these things get get attacked, then something has gone horribly wrong. Okay, and then we want the Buzzard Ramjets because these don't require any field run. Let's grab about two of them. Boop, boop. Do 1.15. Actually, we can go a little bit lower. 0.05. Make this a little bit larger. There we go. 
There is our new hauler. Cool. Then settings for this guy. Oh, when the system is under attack. Okay, so that's that's the, the thing I made with the mining on accident. I told them to dock when there are no enemies in the system. I made them a military ship. And only dock on planets. Automation orders, don't worry about that. Just trade and retrofit when a new design is available. Let's go ahead and save that. And then let's go to our miners so we can change that docking thing system. Um, boop. Oh, and uh, what else do we have? Automatically dock, work with miner. Um, there we go. It has two mining tools, so I guess that's how that works. Automatically retrofit. Don't get any um, fuel because we'll have a, a uh, tanker going around get, making sure you have fuel. All right, and save. And then same thing with the advanced parts. Dock when the enemy, when the station place gets under attack. Don't worry about your fuel. Work with both your tools and retrofit. And then electronic, same thing. Uh, docking only when the system is under attack. Work with both tools. Do not worry about fuel. Okay. I need to grab all my haulers this area and get them the retrofit retrofit and a retrofit sure. cool uh, whoop, retro Apparently we're being called by an AI. What do you want, Oron? You want to give me a bunch of research, a bunch of advanced parts, which we have a decent amount now. Um, in return, you'll give me a bunch of resources. Or you or you want a, a bunch of luxuries. I mean, we still need advanced parts. We're still low on it. I think we'll share 3,300 research with them. We're still in last. But honestly, getting a slower research speed wouldn't be a bad idea, because it'll give us more time to build up our economy before our stuff starts upgrading again. So I'm going to actually go ahead and prove that. Or did he do the opposite? Hang on. No, he gave me a bunch of research. Okay, never mind. Never mind, I read that backwards. I read that completely backwards. Also, this is supposed to be in this orientation. Oh yeah, that's right. In our last episode, we have a bunch of ammo ship and tankers coming in to try to <laughs> keep our ships alive. That's okay if we, if we actually lose this fleet. I'm not too worried about it. I think I'm going to go ahead and rebuild our fleets. And I'm going to have um, have each one of our fleets be its own category. So we'll have a defense fleet with a couple tankers and um, whatnot. Then we'll have a ion cannon fleet and then we'll have an assault frigate fleet. They do want to redesign those um, to not pick up fuel because I want my tankers to supply them fuel. So I don't want them to get ammo. I don't want them to get fuel. All I want them to do is defend the system and we'll retrofit whenever we have time. I want to control that. Hey, okay. uh, or should we do it? Yeah, I want to control that. So let's go ahead and do that for the ion frigate. And then the defense frigate, same thing. Let's defend the system. Uh, and my assault frigate, whoop. Not with the one I wanted to click. The self frigate and the system. Oh 
comes my tanker. Try to get fuel before we lose our ships. Hello. These defense grids have so much health. Okay. Um how are we doing on our development of this system? This one's getting there. This one's not doing too bad. Slowly getting there. Got another message from an AI. You want Icar? You will give me a bunch of research and a bunch of goods per sec. I don't know if you actually have that many, but okay. If I give you a bunch of luxuries. No. I can't take on more research. I have another economic problem if my um, research starts getting out of hand again. Start researching too quickly. And how are we doing over here? That's one of the haulers. I guess I forgot to uh, be able to do things. Um, these retrofit. Thank you. Same with you. Go ahead and retrofit. Get rid of those tankers. Just rebuild that ship. As far as no advanced parts. Okay. Why? He's unpopular today. Alright, what do you want, Albedo? You want to give me a bunch of uh, goods for a bunch of luxuries. I don't need either one. Thanks for the offer. Two asteroid uh, belts here. Is there any other area that really has a bunch of asteroid belts? Here's one down here. Electronics. Uh, do do do. you, you are the military one. I'm pulling a planetary shield generator on you. Um, for the time being, it's 40k, holy. Build me like four of these first, if you don't mind. Really need electronics. That's kind of our problem, because until we solve electronics, we're not going to solve advanced parts. Hey, Alrighty. How much fuel do you guys have left? You guys are cycling fuel to each other. Well. Fill up the entire fleet. Looks like you did. Alright. See if I can solve this real quick. Transfer. Um, 6,000. Oh. Fuel. There you go. Okay. Next split it up between everyone. I do kind of wish it was an easier way to do stuff like this. But there isn't. Uh, 
How's our development going? Not bad, not bad. This one is fully developed. Nice. Can't really expand until we get our electronics under control. You guys still aren't mining, even though I've told you both to mine with, a, with your miner. Okay. See how much better you guys are working. Yep, a lot better now. Cool. Both advanced parts, aren't you? Nope, this one's electronic. Kill. Get over here in mine. Get over here in mine. It's still exporting at a decent speed. Oh, there's so many miners over here. Find you. All you guys are metal miners. And mine. should help this system develop a little bit faster too. Yeah, that was really starting to develop. I'm gonna get you a couple haulers. And then start getting some defenses going too. How are we doing over here? <gasps> Got a metal miner. Go make me some metal. Or, uh, electronic miner. That's kind of the one that we're lacking right now. Our fleet over here is still hanging out. All these haulers have been updated. Now they don't require any fuel. They can run for as long as they can. And more electronic miners. Let's mine these asteroids. Just got a couple more miners. Cool. Mm -hmm. Man, you guys aren't extracting fast enough. Okay. Should be exporting faster than I can process. So it doesn't get a, a backlog like it currently is doing. Wait a minute. Something right here. Forty-one and forty. 
You must just be mining that quickly. Okay. Updated. Go over here and get retrofitted. There I have you. Go over here and get retrofitted. You can work the way you're supposed to. And now let's go back over to here. Got more of these guys. Let's go over here and you mine that asteroid. You go over here and mine that asteroid. Nope, don't park in orbit. Um, mine. And then I need you to build me anchor. Okay. How are we doing over here? We are mostly developed. We're fully developed. Nice. We're fully developed. You're almost there. You got a few more to go, and you got a few more to go. You're my scientific one, so <laughs> we're gonna get a huge boost to research. Have a little bit more to go. And then we need to start building defenses on you. So you. Um, you're the main system, so build build three because you're a military system. And you're also a pretty big planet too, so like you have a decent amount of defenses. How are we doing? We're six on research. We have a research um, partner right now. Only got him for one more minute, so it's not too bad as I thought it would be. And we got military number six. That's also because we kind of lost our fleet, lost half of our fleet due to them running out of fuel. We're we'll gonna be fixing that here shortly. I think, I think we might go ahead and start taking over the system. Let's see, what do you want, Albedo? You will give me advanced parts per second for electronics. Sorry, buddy, I don't have any electronics to give you. That's something else. Orion, what do you want? You will give me a crap ton of food if I give you a lots of luxuries. Uh, I don't have a luxury or a food problem right now, so nope, that's not a good deal for me. I want to expand, but I also I want to get the electronic market working properly. That way we can expand a little bit better. I still need to build a couple defenses on some of these systems that don't have any defenses yet. Like we need some down here, but the, the system I used to build defenses is still under construction. It almost has its shield generator completed. Finding so many electronics right now. Are we still focusing on electronics? We are. What is, we have a 36,000 electronic demand at the moment. It's dropping pretty rapidly. The things that are requiring electronics are being built, which is nice. Oh, something else got queued for electronics. That one went way back up. I think most of it is this. We're gonna run out of advanced parts here shortly because we're not making any. Because we're not making enough electronics to run it all. Uh, I think most of it that requires electronics is like the stuff around here. Like this guy that wants to build a planetary shield generator. <laughs> That's gonna take a good chunk of our electronics. Looks like our research thing wore off, which is good, because we're down to seven now in research. Cool. Slowly getting better. And I have a feeling once we take over this system, we're going to probably start going through the ranks. 
Because I think we're kind of at the point where all the AI are. The AI is probably still trying to figure out how to expand, but I think they have economic problems because they advanced too quick in the research like I did. How many miners do we have up here? Kind of curious. Asteroid. I won the thing mining the asteroid. Uh, we got five normal miners, we have one advanced miner, and we have two electronics. Um, we could probably build a couple more electronic miners, because that's kind of our problem right now. Like, three more. Is there a planetary shield built? Ah, we did! This, this system now has a planetary shield on it of uh, 53k. Not bad. Not bad at all. I mean, I can also put more planetary shields on it to increase the maximum amount of shield that the planet has as well. If I put a second one on, it'll have like 106k. It'll have double the regeneration rate it currently has. There's a lot of really interesting things you can do in this game. Really love it. We got four electronics here. Okay. Yeah, wasn't the system down here supposed to be like electronic focused? Thank you. No, I made you like everything. So you make electronics, you make metal, and you make advanced parts. Was one here I think was electronic focused? Nope, you're metal focused. You are electronic focused. Okay. You have a couple things offline because I didn't make your, your stuff big enough. Oops. Nine million in the hole. One like one scientific laboratory offline, and you have a planetary uh, defense cannon offline. Um. I think you have one of the electronic things. I mean, how much is it hurting you? Times six, work efficiency 83%. As the cities get larger, um, this will fix itself. Not too big of a deal. You actually have a problem with trading. You're not making enough because you're not bringing enough metal in. Okay. So, let's go ahead, move one of those, and build yourself another spaceport. How are the other ones doing? I mean, you're still constructing, so I can't really judge you too much yet. Um, you're a scientific laboratory. I think this is the other one. You have the same problem. Nope, never mind. You're the one I'm trying to solve. Is it you? You're the other metal one? Yeah. You're fine. You're exporting all of your metals. Wait a minute. Hang on. Is it two metals for one electronic? Is that the problem that's going on? We may have to re-redesign all these uh, mining ships. Because if that's true, then that means advanced parts is three metals, one electronic. And uh, electronics are two metals. Ah. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Yep. It's two metals for one electronic. Oh. 
Of course it is. Of course it is. Back to the drawing board. So for electronic, um, this means... Oh, I'm, I'm just going to wait until we get done with level 11. So all the technology is oop, in sync. And we'll get all that stuff fixed. Hey, making 126. Oh yeah, it used to be 900. I was like, that went up a lot. Um, but you, I could get rid of your farm. I don't really want to, I could do it. All right, something went to my attention. What do you want? You will give me research. You'll give me advanced parts per second for 152 if I give you electronics. Well, one, I don't need the research. I'm still researching too fast compared to what I want to. Um, and I don't have the electronics to give you because I actually have electronics shortage. So, no. Go away. Alright, you're building your shield generator. Building your electronic your factory. I guess... We're going to go ahead and remove that. Then we're going to build another electronic factory. Or actually, no, no. You need population, so let's build yourself a city. Because we're only running at 85% right now. So let's get that going. Boom, boop, boom, boop. Forget that these guys have a bunch of storage. There we go. That will cause this to go up as work efficiency rises. Kill. All right. Still trying to solve that electronic shortage. does look like it's getting easier and easier to actually get this to go up so that's good and once we re redesign our stuff should have everything good to go what do you want Oran? you want to share resources with me and give me a crap ton of electronics for for luxuries or not electronics advanced parts I am getting low on advanced parts but that's also because of the electronic shortage I haven't been able to make electronic or advanced parts because I can't ship in electronics. Hmm. This will give me 6,200 research for 570. Ooh. I can't. I can't solve my economic problems if I keep going through all my research. Because everything keeps retrofitting. So I actually need to slow down my research until we get this electronic shortage unsolved. Hopefully, here shortly, we should get it solved. This one is exporting 179 electronics. Ooh, oh, it's drying. It's getting really close. Really, really close. Or now it's just going up because the population level is growing. Hmm. 
Cool. This planet is developed. That one's developed. This one is developed now. It's building its uh, defense systems. Cool. How are we doing on a demand? We have like 3,000 demand electronics and it's dropping. Nice. We should start stockpiling here shortly. And then once I get these designed the way they're supposed to be, that's why this isn't actually filling up. Um, because I, I don't actually have this design properly. <laughs> they are helping, but they're not helping as well as they should be. Got your tanker made. You're, get, you're renovating your stuff now. Cool, cool. Electronics are now stockpiling. Holy crap. Cool. Let that stockpile for a while. Probably get up to maybe 50k and then I can turn off the focus for electronics. Finally. Woo. And this system up here. We could probably start going, but again, I'm going to wait until we stockpile the 50k because we are still going through research, which means our planets are upgrading and whatnot. I do want to build, let's see, system. I want to see how many miners we actually have in the system right now. I have two of them, all right. I have one of them that's not even doing anything. Two of them that aren't even doing anything. Seven electronics. We need a couple more advanced parts around here. Go over there and mine that. There and mine that. You build me two of the advanced parts one. Do the same thing with our other asteroid system, wherever it is. I think we only have two asteroid systems. Yeah, we have this one and the other one. This one has four electronics. Build two advanced parts here too, just to keep that one up with demand. That's gonna be our next problem. And I need to make the export a little bit faster than we can produce. That way, it makes sure make sure that the uh, that this is completely empty. Cool. At, at least we solved our, our economy problem. Everything is in the green now. Advanced parts is a, struggling a little bit. But once I set the economy focus to equal again, that should hopefully balance itself out. Okay, you get over here, mine that. I'm trying to find my tankers. Tankers! Why not have any tankers? They do, I just don't know where they went. Yoing, 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 yoing. Alright, well, once you're done with that, build me two tankers. Maybe three. This is a pretty big mining operation. Okay. Um, what do you want? You will give me a visibility of your territory. You also give me a crap ton of food, which I really don't need, or a crap ton of luxuries. And you'll give me visibility for about 10 minutes. Hmm. Don't really need anything.
do not really need it. Okay, and where is the other system? It's over here. You got your tanker up there. About to build your advanced ship. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and turn my electronic focus back off so we're back to normal. Start mining. Then we have another one up here. You get over here and mine this asteroid. Hee <laughs> hee. There's the tanker. Going. All right. Now we're starting to look really, really good. Cool. I am so happy we actually were able to um, solve this problem. Going. Wait for that guy to get built, and then now we might start building defenses. And then we also, I'm going to start expanding into this area, but I do want to get some much needed defenses going on in some of our territory. Because we have. Like, this territory down here doesn't have anything yet. So build yourself a couple defenses. Once the primary area gets completed, then we'll start building some defenses on the secondary areas. Kind of like how that area is over there. And um, you have your first defense system going too. So cool. Get in the military, built up. What do you want, Icar? You'll give me uh, visibility for a bunch of advanced parts, I give you 944 luxuries for 700 seconds. I actually kind of need those advanced parts because I'm low. And I think I have a pretty good income when it comes to luxuries. Let's see, where are we? Yeah, we're making like over 5,000 a second, so I can afford that. So yeah, let's go ahead and do that and we'll check out uh, that AI system, see what he's up to. Well, cool. So now we have the income to start building more defenses, get some of these sectors secured. So if we ever get attacked, um, we'll be able to hold them off for a while before needing to build a fleet, build an actual military fleet that we can be using to start attacking some of these sectors or start spying on some of these sectors. Get this area all secured and um, colonized now that we have an economic income and then maybe even start upgrading or increasing the size of our stations and our ships. That would be awesome. Um, but let's let's see where this AI is. He's over here, and ooh, he has this sector that has six I or six planets. Wow, it's a lot of planets. Is this one over here that also that has seven planets? <laughs> Sometimes, like in really big sectors, you can have like seven, eight, or nine planets. Very very important. Uh, but let's see, these cruisers have 67,000 health, size 9.8, and but they're out of date. We have a tanker here that's a size 19, 78,000 just for the freaking tanker. And it's out of date. Ooh. Yeah. Why we need to start building larger ships. What else do they have? Is that the only thing they have? Wow. Is that the only military they have? Not much of a military, honestly. Really isn't. Like, the health is impressive. But this is it. That's that's not much. That's not much at all. It has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24 planets we have 21 but yeah if we get it if we secure this next sector we'll start going up on colonization which will help with our economy and research cool 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 
So, I think after you get those done, I want you to build me four colony ships. And then start building your defenses. Now this sector over here, this planet is still building up its defenses. Once it gets completed, then we'll start building like single defenses on all planets. So they have something defending them. I might even start designing like a defense fighter or something so I can build a few of those on these to protect the uh, the system. That might not be a bad idea. How big of fighters can I make? We can build 4.05. Wow, so our fighters that we can currently build are almost as big as our frigates. So yeah, that's that's why I'm saying that we need to make our ships bigger. Um, we're getting we're gonna start getting a um, out of date just because of our size. We got good technology, but we don't have really big um, ships yet. Oh boy. But I am really curious to see what new updated ships that these guys can build. All their cruisers are extremely out of date. It's got a decent fleet, it's it's just not updated. If I ever play around with the AI in my mod, the first thing I'm gonna do is make sure that they always have their fleet up to date. Because the AI is treating this as a pretty large fleet, but because of the fact our technology and everything is so out of date, it can just easily die. So I lost contact with them for some reason. Was that not the AI I was supposed to spy on? Isn't that the AI that gave me his uh, sensors? Oh, oh. Okay, that's one of the guys I'm at war with. These are the ones that are actually that guy. Okay. He's being attacked by pirates. Hm. you have any defenses? Do you have anything whatsoever? I have... This is out of date. A size 19 cruiser, 170,000 health. That's more than our stations. It's pretty big. We have a Crusader class of 14.9, 131k. Uh, ooh, you have a guard platform. This is up to date. You have a defense platform that is a size 21. Almost double the size of our current defense stations with 213,000 health. Okay. That's actually not too bad compared to ours. Let's see what ours would be if we if we set the size 21. Two hundred and three k health, and we would have 21,000 shields. So that's actually not that far off from our technology. But then again, I think the AI only uses um, uh, plate armor, which has really high health compared to the more advanced armors. So they're still a little bit more advanced than we are. Keep that in mind. Whenever we start building up a fleet, when we, whenever we get to the point um, to where we're going to start going to war with other AI. <laughs> I mean, we're at war, but we're so far away from, like, this guy. He... Um, are they? These guys. That it just hasn't really mattered. Ooh, and this is a heavily, uh, a fortified rendement on planet. Dude. Okay. Um, so let's go ahead and keep this going. And I want to... I think I already queued it. Yeah, I queued it. I'm gonna send these colonial um colony not colonial ships colony ships up here take over this area start getting this area developed and as our money continues to grow we will continue to build up our defenses and when we get to a certain point and get our economy running to a certain point i might upgrade our entire um fleet <laughs> oh this one has a bunch of moons around it cool
Right now, we are number five on military. Alright. Well, um, go ahead and go here. Colonize that planet. And like I said, I'm going to probably, um, uh, redo my entire fleet and kind of like make them specialized. I also want to get like a, a fourth ship going too. I was thinking like making like a missile destroyer, a ship that just has a bunch of missile launchers on it. I think that would be cool. So then we have an ion cannon frigate, an assault frigate, a um, heavily defensive foot frigate, and a missile frigate. Be a good variety going on. Um, you, advanced part guy, get over here and start mining. Appreciate it. Going around and giving fuel to all of the uh, ones. Well, the only problem about the tankers is I wish I could make the tankers exclude themselves in the when they check out ships around for fuel. That's how this keeps happening. Where they're like giving each other fuel. Although they are still keeping the uh Although when things actually happen, they do come in and, and try to give fuel to the to the fleet. So they are still doing what they're supposed to do. They just kind of loop whenever, uh, um, when there's nothing to do. Colonize that planet. Make. Our resources are looking very good. This guy has two defense systems built. He's currently building his last one. This guy is renovating his laboratories. How are all you guys looking on that stuff? You are completely good to go. You still don't have enough money to run your laboratory or enough population. Oh, you're a different one. You're good to go. Oh, and I also just realized that we've gotten through um, a level 12 research. Not too bad. So I could get rid of one of these. Making 1.1k. Holy crap. <laughs> uh, nope, not blueprints. That's not what I wanted. I wanted you. Uh, let's see, you'll give me a bunch of research and a bunch of food for my electronics. I just got my electronics under control, so I am not making that trade. Electronics is still the lowest compared to all my other ones. A nice planet. Then we need to colonize this, and then I need to figure out what I want these plants to be. Probably a couple of them will be economic. Um... I think we're still good on goods and luxuries, so I don't really need that. Same thing with farms. So this, this might be an economic se sector. I need to get all of this up so we can build larger, larger ships and defense stations. So when we get attacked, we'll have a decent defense to fight back. Because we can almost build fighters bigger than our normal ships. Kind of, uh, kind of crazy. Spoken out loud. Research stuff is being upgraded. Let's get to the next research tier. It's gonna kill our electronics for a while because uh, my scientific laboratories usually takes a lot of everything. What else do you have queued? Oh yeah, your defense station. Cool. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna turn this into an economic center, where all of these, all of these uh, planets here are just gonna be economy focused. 
probably have one metal focus, one electronic focus, one advanced part focused, and then one all of them focused. I think that's going to be my plan for that sector. Go ahead, move you up here. Um, I want to colonize. And I think we are going to go ahead and end this episode here. Um, let's go check our ally one more time. I'm curious to see what he's doing. Trying to take back more planets. This area is being attacked by pirates. Um, but he does have a decent ship size. I'm kind of curious to see what ours are compared to his. So let's go to our assault frigate. Make it 14.9 because that's what he's currently using. And we have 108k. He has 131. But we're also using a different armor style, so we are probably close to each other when it comes to research tier. Good to know. Good to know. Uh, but yeah, anyways guys, I hope you enjoy this. Uh, please leave a like if you did. If you like what I do, consider subscribing. Uh, oh. Hang on. Oh, that's a different type of ship. Okay. Much larger, too. What is it compared to ours? You have 137k. I have 170. So, we are similar to the AI um, on when it comes to technology, but we need to get our economy going so we can build larger ships. That way we'll be a match for them. We will have the advantage right now that um, small ships build quick, but if we can't do the firepower to take down the enemy, there's no point of having like 50 ships that can't actually like go through the armor of a uh, of the AI, because I believe the larger you make the ship, the uh, better the um, absorption. No, maybe I'm. I think I'm thinking of uh, da -da -da, uh, damage reduction. Um, for plate armor, there's like little no plant damage reduction because it's just plate. Um, but like nano has higher, ablative has higher. It's like 78.5. If we shrink that. Um, 54. Yeah, so the larger the, the ship, the more damage reduction the armor has. So, yeah. One reason why we have to make sure we keep upgrading our ships and keeping up with the AI. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. Please leave a like if you did. If you like what I do, consider subscribing, and I will check you guys out in the next video. Oop! It's not... Uh-uh. That's not what I wanted to happen! Until next time, guys. This is Captain Soban signing out. Emergency hyperspace procedures initiated.